actually handle because this, like I said, this is a pre-set up car in a quick race. Oh my god, there we go. What? We can actually do this? Come on, come on, come on, get the whole course. We can actually drift the whole course. What's up everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on Drift 21. There was an update for force feedback, physics fields, and everything like that. So we're going to take a look at them as well as a new game feature called Quick Race. So we're going to take a look at all of that here for today. Make sure you guys follow me on social media. I'll put your phone in the description box below. Let's get to it. So I did click Quick Race so we can see what it goes to. So we do have my S15. Oh. Oh, it's not my S15. We have a... 600 power S15, 45. Oh, so we have some built cars. So we're going to take out the S15. Why not? And we're going to see we have the Toge. We have North Course. So we have a new course as well. Hmm. But we're going to test out the physics at Driftland just to see what they have changed. So hopefully my wheel is connected and we're good to go. So let's see if everything works out how it's supposed to in the beginning. Um, no. All right, so we got our wheel finally set up. Oh, the wheel's very stiff. So new physics, new feedback. Let's see what it's like. Actually, not bad. At all. Oh, I like these physics. So the physics have been updated and they feel really good right now, actually. The front feels like it has grip. Actually able to get a bunch of sidewaysness here in this 15. I don't know if it's maybe the way the car is set up or whatever, but we're actually able to get sideways. The physics does feel good, so let's try going on another track that we actually have to pay attention to and maybe actually run. The toge or no, we'll go to the north course. We'll select the north course and we'll go try do north course and see if we can get a good drift at north course because well I'm liking how the physics are feeling. So the update of physics, the update of the wheel. And these are set on my Aceta Corsa. Fanatec settings. Okay, so there's a little bit of uh, a little bit of weight on the wheel. We are actually able to keep a drift. You guys remember watching this video in the beginning when the game first came out? The wheel was kind of numb feeling, and it was very hard to transition. Now it does have a very good feel. Get handbrake in. See if we can actually get a good entry. I kicked that too early. Oh, we're gonna retry that. I kicked that too early. I got over aggressive and overzealous on that. So this is not my car. This is one of the pre-built cars. I feel like we need to turn the force feedback down a little bit. So go to one of my actually we'll go to this one that's authentic with a little less feedback see how this one feels I'll take this hairpin real quick
Yep. It doesn't get as light. It doesn't get as numb feeling like it was before. So let's uh, let's rip this north course and see if we can't actually get a good drift. Oh, logged it in there. May not have been the cleanest, but you know what? It was a lot better than the previous ones. We can actually drift the whole course now. I'm super excited on this. This actually feels quite good. And uh, I'm actually super excited about this, the way they've adjusted the physics and stuff like that, because now I feel like I could actually take my cars to the actual courses and actually do some of the drift, drift things with them. So I think we're gonna do another episode here on Drift 21 with some of the uh, some of my cars and some challenges and see if we can get my cars to actually handle. Because this, like I said, this is a pre-set up car in a quick race. Oh my god, there we go. What? We can actually do this? Come on, come on, come on, get the whole course. We can actually drift the whole course. That was sick. So let's go try some of the other cars because, well... I'm feeling uh, I'm feeling a little bit good right now. I'm feeling I'm liking the way the wheel feels. The wheel feels really good right now. So let's go to Maname, and we're gonna select that, and we're gonna change up cars. I think we're gonna run. We don't have an RX-8 built, so we're gonna take the RX-8 out, even though that this, that fitment is just that fitment is just no. I'm not not feeling that fitment at all, but we'll take it out anyways. Let's go to Maname, see what we can do with Maname. Hope you guys are enjoying these episodes here on Drift 21. Definitely gonna be doing. Oh, I didn't change course. Ah, oh, rip on my part. Quit session. Fail. Maname select. There we go. Now we're gonna be on Maname. Maybe jump drifts. Oh, I feel like we can get them. We were never able to drift really any courses before. The arcade does feel a little bit different than the uh, 15, but. Drifting it like I would be drifting the Assetto Corsa section. But we can hold a drift. If you don't know how excited I am about these physics updates and the wheel feel force feedback settings because that makes this game so much more fun to play. Ooh! Makes this game so much more worth it. All right, jump trip time. Not the greatest of jump drifts, but we managed to come around. Oh, you, this feels so good. I've never had so many drift points and completed drifts in Drift 21 since this game came out. We lost it there because we kind of ran that way. So Drift 21, definitely a huge improvement on how the wheel feels. It feels very stiff, very aggressive. So let's see if we can't turn that down just a smidge because it is definitely a very aggressive on there. 
main power. We're going to drop main power down to, I want to say, 80. We're going to drop main power down to 80 and see what 80 feels like. All right, 80 feels good. It's not it's not like ripping my hand out of my uh out of its place. I'm going to try one last jump trip for today's episode. Oh. Wall tap. Drift 21 coming back with a banger update with feedback. Yep. I like it. I like it a lot. So I think that's going to do it here for this episode here on Drift 21. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. If you guys play Drift 21 and you guys have tried the new feedback, let me know what you guys think about it. Definitely going to try and maybe get my buddy on here and get his impressions on it. So as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.